where we off to, Matt? Nikki Beach. I happened to walk downstairs because when we arrived at the hotel, the lifts broke. And of course, we are on the top floor, the eighth floor. So, that requires every day stairs. At least I don't have to do the gym anymore, even though Matt goes for a run, we've got the stairs. So Matt, two years. Yeah. What has it been like being with me for two years? It's been an absolute dream come true, baby. No, you don't have to lie to them, this <laughs> can be real. Oh, wow. Um, there's definitely been a Get adventure. your head, mate, you're too far behind me. I'm sorry. You're too tall. It's been um, we've had a lot of good times. We've had our squabbles. But um, I think in the end, we have come together and our relationship is full of love and lies. respect for one another. <laughs> love and lies. <laughs> yeah. So it's like a break, this is like a breakup speech. Yeah. It's like, yeah, so I do love you, but we're going to have this one last day and then tomorrow I'm flying home and you're here on your own. I can't do the stairs anymore. Anyway, guys, this camera holding it while doing the stairs is not good for me. I've got a dead arm and dead legs and bad breathing, so we will see you at Nikki Beach with what's your favourite cocktail, Matt? I already know the answer, but these guys do. Strawberry daiquiri. Yes, that is our favourite, it's our, our holiday drink. What is going on with my hair? I literally look like I've been electrocuted. Also guys, make sure you wear sun cream. I definitely put sun cream on when we went to Nikki Beach, but the sun is so strong here, me and Matt look like two lobsters that have just crawled out of the sea. Huh. <laughs> but we had, what? Crabs. Lobsters are red as well, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, always likes to correct me. We survived our first part of our anniversary with no arguments, no rows, and we're still going rock strong. Still going, <laughs> we're, still going, we're still going wrong. You can't win, guys, and Carl. Still can't do anything right, me. Still going strong. I feel like it so naturally came out. We're going to make it to two years in one day, I think. Um, but we've just come back to the room. Had a lovely day, Nikki Beach was so fun. We've had lots of white sangrias, our strawberry daiquiris, our favorite. We had some nice food. We met this big group of lovely gals that were from, where were they from? Cheltenham. Cheltenham. And Southampton. And Southampton. So we kind of spent majority of our day with them. Shout out to them. Shout out to them if they're watching. I'm not gonna name all the names because I forgot some unto would be here all day. There was like 16 of them. I just love going to a place with no expectations and just like meeting random people that you don't know. Um, like the unexpected days are always the best days. Even though obviously Nikki Beach was planned, but you know what I mean, kind of the day was not planned. Um, but we've just come back to change. 
we really don't have much time. I'm standing here filming and actually, you we've got like, in the shower. yeah, I should be in the shower. We've got like a half an hour to get ready, but we were just enjoying ourselves so much. We lost track of time. Do you know what I mean? But anyway, my voice is also starting to go. So I do need to rest it because I've been screaming and shouting and talking above music all day. But yeah, I'm gonna jump in the shower, get ready, and then tonight, what's the restaurant called about? Iletta. 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 I'll let you know how it is. I'll show you some footage when we're there. And then I'll probably close this vlog off tomorrow. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be a really lovely restaurant, so fingers crossed it continues the brilliant day that we've already had. And I need to put some Atherson on because I do look like a lobster. Or a crab, as Matt said. How's our anniversary so far, Matt? Farmer. How's our anniversary so far? Oh, I thought you said, oh, how's our anniversary say farmer? No, I said, how's our anniversary so far? Perfect. Say farmer. I was like. We are in the most romantic setting. We've beautiful. got all of this going on. Some yachts over there. We've had the sunset. Currently got a paella with my favorite person. Cheers. <laughs> Guys, I don't know how long I'm going to be able to hold this camera up, so I might speak quick. I've got such a dead arm. I've just been to the gym. It just shows how unfit I am already. I think coming on holiday, I always have the intention of like, I'm going to go to the gym every day. I'm going to keep fit. And then eight days later, here we are, a dead arm from holding a camera up, a tomato face from doing a little bit of fitness. I felt like I had to go to the gym this morning. Um, I'm not going to lie. We are not the day after the anniversary. We are not still at the start of the holiday. Um, I completely forgot to switch the vlog off after our anniversary, so we have two days left. I feel like all this holiday I've done is eat, drink, sleep, repeat, but that is what holidays are all about. Um, it has been an incredible trip. We've got two days left. I feel really sad that the holiday's coming to an end, but I do feel like when you go on holiday, it's all about kind of switching off. It's about refreshing. It's about going home with a new perspective, and I really feel like this holiday has done that. Um, I'm not kind of like so ready to get home, but when I do get home, I'm so ready to kind of like push in my career, push in life, and I'm just going home with a new perspective um, on everything. I think it just really makes you appreciate life and, and just, yeah, switching off and going home with a clear mind. So that is kind of why I forgot to vlog the ending of this video because the past couple of days we have been to some lovely restaurants we've been on really nice walks we went on a boat one of the days in this beautiful cove having lunch um now i have captured some content so i will be sharing that over my instagram so i'll put the little handle down below me here and the link in the description box if you want to go and check it out also i will be doing if you guys ever come to mallorca on my instagram i'll be doing like a, a recommendations of bars clubs uh beach places places to walk because I feel like when you go on holiday, you don't want to be disappointed. So if you're just kind of like trying to find places, sometimes you can be disappointed with where you end up going. So I think it's best to go on recommendations. So I mean, I, I'm not saying I know best, but there will be some recommendations on there for you all in case you do visit and want to know kind of some of the places that we went to. But yeah, our anniversary kind of taken this back. I think it's like five, six days. We've made it, by the way, to two years and six days. Success. I mean, we're on the way to three now. Um, but our anniversary was just so perfect. We had the best day at Nikki Beach. Um, we probably drank a little bit too much because then it was like a, oh my God, now we've got a romantic dinner to get to. But we managed to have a shower, refresh and get back out. The dinner, you couldn't have asked for a p more perfect setting. If this camera's shaking, by the way, I apologize. My arm is, I'm really pushing on through here. This is like torture holding the camera. Um, the, the restaurant we went to was like, on an island kind of out at sea and you walk down this kind of decking that you would have seen on the footage and it was just so stunning sitting there having cocktails watching the sunset and then having some beautiful fish food we have a lovely paella um and yeah it was just amazing and my tan i don't know if it's shown properly on this camera but is has really topped up which is good everyone wants to go home with a tan if you go home whiter than when you came I mean, I would certainly be disappointed. I think you also notice your tan as well more when you get home because everyone's like, 
a lot more pale than you even though it is summer in the UK but I feel like then you really notice the enhancement of your tan but I am going to close this vlog off here guys thank you so much for being a part of such a special day for us the two-year anniversary I just felt like I didn't really want to vlog the whole trip because as I said I wanted to switch off but I felt like I wanted to include you guys in that because for years I have done videos about being single and about being on my own and not finding love and and all of that so I felt like it would be wrong of me not to do a video now on the success story of now I am with someone and happy and made it to two years which I don't know where those two years have gone they have flown by I feel like we've been married for like 40 even though we're not even that age yet but um yeah when I get home I'm ready to get going again so some fun vlogs are coming your way I'm gonna go and pick up the dog the day after I get home so I might kind of vlog my reunion with him and kind of do like a, a getting back to reality video so that will be the week after this one so if you did enjoy this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel and i'll be seeing you guys next week on another vlog now i'm going to go enjoy my last two days here top up the tan a little bit more we have one more night out tonight by the way which is going to be a really messy one um a club here have asked if we want to have a table at the club so we were like do you know what it's our last proper night without like the day after tomorrow we're flying home so it's our last proper night where we could stay out late we are very boring we've been in bed every night kind of before 12 30 so tonight we're like come on we're still young let's push it past kind of 1am we just love like a chilled day and drinking the day and then going to bed early i know it's so boring but that's us anyway now i'm chatting a load of rubbish i'll see you guys next week on another vlog take care see you then